Hi everyone, welcome to my channel, Plans by T. Um, so yeah, I'll be doing a haul, and as you can see by the the black lines and squares, this is going to be a printables haul. I buy a lot of printables, but I never actually do a haul. Um, but since I've been buying a lot lately, I decided to say some, and then I bought some more recently. From two dollar Tuesdays and just include kind of a collective haul of the printable shops that I've bought um, in the last few weeks of May. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get started. All right, so the first shop, the first shop I'm gonna show you is Paper and Gumption. Her kit is called um, Be a Unicorn, and I absolutely love this kit um, for the summer. If you've been watching any of my videos, you know that I use a lot of neutral tones, but I wanted to, um, as the summer comes, move into some more bright spreads. And I like that this is bright, but it's still, to me, sort of like on the pastel side. Well, there are pastels, um, so I really love this kit. And then she's recently changed her formats where she has them sectioned off, so when you send it through your silhouette, if you have one, this would cut off. And then this would cut up into two separate boxes. And then also what's inside of the boxes would cut off. And then it will have her shop name on um, each um, page. It just makes it a little easier for you to store. Now I haven't cut them yet. Or most of them I haven't cut yet. I did cut a few of them. But I wanted to go ahead and film this before I started to cut. So here are the full boxes. You have the um, checklist, some appointment labels, some half boxes more appointment labels and this is her deco page so you have some fonts I mean some scripts some date dots some deco more page flags you have your sidebar stuff some ombre boxes and then I really love when kids include these page dividers and then this is the headers you have some more circle icons And then she does have her kits where you can either print off the um, ombre boxes or you can print them off just like the checklist. And since this kit has so much color in it, I decided to get the, the mostly plain check boxes. And then here are her bottom wash in date covers, the weekend flag, and then an extra full box. And then she does include both skin tones, so I did print this out for me. And then here are the glitter headers, and then some more deco, and then some work icons and bows. So that is from Paper and Gumption. This next kit is from, I'm just going to store this right here, um, Prince Petticoat Bandit. Now I recently found her shop. I have used a couple of her kits and I recently picked this one up. Um, this is her Hello Spring. Now this one is formatted for the Happy Planner. I wasn't paying attention <laughs> and I ordered it for the Happy Planner. Um, the Happy Planner boxes fit the width but the length is going to be a bit longer which I don't mind. So I'll go ahead and go through her kit. Again you have the full boxes, some sidebar um, stickers, you have some checklists. I believe this is either, this is washi, some page flags. I love her um, characters. I believe she hand draws those. You have some more icons. Here you have her headers, more checklists, washi, and then your little things, and then some more big page flags. You have her icons. I love her icons. Some half boxes and quarter boxes, and then some, I believe this is washi. You know, washi, but glitter headers. I haven't cut them up yet, so I don't know, but I do believe these are glitter headers. And then you have her, the page flags, not page flags, but the date covers, washi, um, some to-do boxes, and then some checklists and the weekend banner. And I'm going to put that over there. Okay. Now I have a pretty big order from this next shop. Go ahead and put them right here. Um, now this is from what is it? Paper Crown Planner. These are from her 
$2 Tuesday that she recently had, so I bought a bunch of stuff. Go ahead and move it out the way. One thing that I'm happy that shops are um, making it where you can cut the kits down because these are pretty big to show on camera. Let me go ahead and zoom in. Now these are some little, I guess they're page flags, like a little piece of washi. Now they came like this, but like I said, some shops are making it where it will cut out for you. So this is the pastel version, and this is the bright version of it. And they're all there, and you get both quarter boxes, and you get half boxes in both colorways. And then, like I said, I bought a lot of stuff from her. Two dollar Tuesdays. This is kind of awkward to film because, like I said, these. Well, I love printable kits. They're kind of big. It's kind of hard to film them. So, I don't know what this kit is called. But it is a summer themed kit. So, here are her icons. She has some scripts. You have your checklist. I love these. Um, the full boxes. I really love her designs. Um, the way she designs her full boxes. So, here is that page. These are the glitter headers, the um, appointment labels, not appointment labels, but your bill dues, some trackers have boxes, little thing in the washi, your date covers, date dots, more page dividers, important your checklist, some page flags, some bows, and then she includes one of these. She's also recently um, updated her format where it prints off two separate um, sheets and she's added a few different um, designs now this one I absolutely love um, I love how it is both bright but it also includes a lot of white stickers because I like to do white space planners so I really love these stickers um, the quote just says be a flamingo in a pigeon world so I'm not going to go over everything because her kits are they're formatted the same so I'll just go through the kit but I won't actually name them off but the artwork in here is so pretty let's go over it for you I love how bright and bold the colors are so like I said as I'm going to move through the summer I do plan on adding more color to my kits so then here is another kit from her um, the quote box says, find what anchors you. So again, now this is going back more softer colors. So I might use this in the fall. Um, I don't use it this summertime. So again, here are the full boxes and the icons. Hope you can see everything. Um, you have your headers, checklists. And then I really love how I really love how plain but yet bold bold on um, the bottom washi is. I love stripes and foils together. It's a very nautical kit. Okay. And this kit again is more softer colors, but I absolutely love it. It just says life is peachy. I might use this this summertime if I use it probably in June. So again, here are the full boxes. So I'll just go through it for you. And I love that bottom washi. Okay. Now, this is the final kit that I got from her. It is a two-page um, monthly kit, which I'll be using this month for June. So here are the top headers. Um, this is going to block out the dates that are not in June. These are for the sidebar. You have your appointment labels, the page flags, and then here's the second part of the kit right here. Now you may be wondering why is it on my cutting mat? Well, when I cut it, when I change pages, let me move this out the way. When I changed pages, I didn't, I forgot to change the setting back. So if I peel it off, you see it's going to 
they're all going to kind of peel off. I don't know if you can see this. Let me ink. They're kind of going to peel and stick to the page. So I just left it on here until I get ready to film it, which I'm going to be filming that next. So while I do love printables, sometimes it can be a pain trying to figure out the settings for um, a silhouette. But I really love the savings so that I, <coughs> excuse me, I know my voice is going out. Um, I really love the savings and the the different options that you get with printable um, kits. You can print them over and over um, if you want. Um, so let me just go ahead and wrap this up. Like I said, I'll be filming my monthly spread using this kit from Paper Crown Planners. Wait a minute, what am I talking about? I still have one more shot. Okay. This is the last shot. Beautiful planning. Okay. So Beautiful Planning is another shop that I use a lot here on my channel. And I bought a couple of kits from her um, last week. So I'll go over the first one. This is called Blossom or Blooms. And I really like the format of her full boxes and her checklist. So this kit really reminds me of a nautical kit, kind of like the one from Paper Crown Planners. It has that stripes and um, stripes and florals. I don't know if they're the same artwork, but I really love this kit. Then here's the second page of it. I love that bottom wash. She is plain, but I really love how pretty the colors are. And then these are the um, you hydrate. You have some appointment labels. You have your little things, glitter headers, and then some more um, headers. And then she gives you two extra full boxes. This is a double box. You have your checklist, some appointment labels, not appointment labels, but um, some full boxes, um, very hard checklist. She also includes um, page dividers. And then here is her functional page. You have some icons, some circles, page flags, little icons, some sidebars, and then you have your date covers and date dots. And that is Blossom. Okay. So this is the next kit. Let me see. And this is on her new format. I don't know the name of this kit. I don't think it's actually on there. Let me just check. Okay, I don't know the name of this kit, but she's recently also changed her format where it has the um, two separate boxes that you can print off. So this is one of the extra sheets that I printed off um, because of the skin tone. So it comes with some deco, some icons, and then some script icons. And you have two full boxes, and then I believe this is like a double full box. And then here are the the page, not page bags, but the full boxes. And I really love this color scheme. It's not, it's bright, but it's not like neon bright. I love the, um, the more muted or I guess the neutral tones. Even though this has red in it and pink, it does have a lot of neutral tones in it. And then this kit just says, here comes the sun. I really love these two boxes. And I plan on going to the beach more because I didn't go a lot last year. And then her bottom while she has it split um, where you have the little strip of glitter headers and then you have your box. You have some more page dividers, um, your date covers, appointment labels, more cyber icons and your page flags. And then she has her three heart ombre boxes. She has her little three heart checklist. I love when shops include the three heart checklist or the ombre um, three heart boxes because I like to do like a top three where this is going to be the three things that I'm going to do today. So I really like that and, put, and I really love her bow boxes. And then she has them in the, I guess the, what is it, five heart list. And I really like these two. And then here are some more three hard boxes, some half boxes, 
And you have your ombre boxes. Here you have your little things, some labels and some glitter headers. And then that is it for that kit. Now this kit is called Planner Addict. So you have, um, this is in her old format I believe. I don't know, but I think yeah, it is in her old format because it doesn't have the name on the side. So again, you have your page dividers, your full boxes, some heart checklists, page flags, and then the weekend banner. That is over for you right quick. And like I said, this kit, I absolutely love it. It's neutral. I can do the neutral and the white space with this one. This kit I'm probably going to use it in the fall. And then it says planner is going to plan. And I really like um, the the photo icons or the photos that she includes with this kit. And then this is her um, the deco, not deco, but the script and then the sidebar stickers. And that is it for that one. And now I am done. Well, I guess I can just leave this out. So yeah, if you guys are looking to plan but you want to save on some money because planning can be quite expensive. Um, I believe that printable shops are a good way to be able to plan but not break your budget. But it does take some time to set up and then you do have to buy the paper and ink so you do have to call it that way but I guess it kind of balances itself out because I think all of this was less than one this is less than I believe $30 for all of this and I can print them again if I want to okay so that does does it for this video so I'm gonna go ahead and film my monthly um, my monthly spread right now with this beautiful kit from Paper Crown Planning so if you want to see that that'll be up next after this video and again if you guys want to save some money on planning I really suggest you check out some of these shops or any other printable shops if you have some printable shops that you like please leave them in the description below I mean in the comments below I will have these shops linked and then I will have the paper that I use linked as well so hope you guys like this video please subscribe if you like and enjoy your week Bye.